Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for you to episode 3 of the Monogatari series, Monster and Off. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> but she is you, babe. <laughs> That would be a little too easy. Yeah, th this is something she's got to do really herself. Go on. Three whole freaking episodes and we got an opening. <laughs> That's so cute, oh my god. <laughs> Really? What if they just change clothes secretly? And see, Flirty was one of those that I was like, nah, you don't gotta worry about her, but damn. There's no way in hell that you can walk all the way over there and get her.
Right. Mm-hmm. ASAP. Before she does, like, even more damage. Let me open the sketchbook and be like... Don't fuck this up. But then you yourself will cease ex exist, and I don't think you really truly want that. That was easy. With time, yeah, but... Mm -hmm. hmm. <gasps> Are we hearing her voice?
Oh my god. <laughs> The fact that Meek is just walking around topless, just <laughs> how the hell are you gonna get her? And you are? Wait, I think I remember you! So pretty. I saw they were just going to give her about best girl. The silhouette and a crab. How I miss her. Hobby. <laughs>
Yes, <laughs> could say that. <laughs> Mm-hmm. You did in a way. Just, you know, by you two just talking. That's usually how it happens. We don't want you to just, you know, always be depressed all the time. That makes sense. That makes sense because of the fact is, yeah, because now she had feelings for him and shit. Okay, was not expecting her to pop up and have a big little conversation with Sengoku because, like, 
that was not on my list today, but hey, I love it. I love me some good ass surprises her in comedy. Especially comedy, because yes, yeah, she's in the poster for it, but I was expecting her to, you know how I'm like, okay. Because sometimes certain sayings or just like in the world of entertainment, so I it sometimes ish. Um let's say a certain person is like too busy to do their role and stuff that nine out of ten it's just like a little phone call interview as space but no they showed scenes of her and i love that like oh so happy but of course yes Mika would definitely like avoid the shit out of her he's like, it's like she doesn't want to see him it's already so awkward enough but i think you know now because our current one she's more mature and such it makes the most sense but okay miss little flirtiness up in here and share her shit like I, I love each moment and it makes me wonder how this next episode is going to go with her because once again every moment of her talking to herself is like it, it's that one conversation like i think a lot of us do eventually have with ourselves where it's like okay we're at this age of this what do we want in our life and such and then you're the inner monologues come out. It, it could be a conversation about, like, anything. It could be your life, um, psh, daily shit. <laughs> Things that you hear from friends, family, you know, or in your, just, you, you have that inner monologue moment where it's, like, different versions of you. You're all sitting in a room together and you're just sitting and you're just talking. You're like, this is how I feel about this. This is how I feel about that. But, like, no, let me question this. Like, should this be a good thing for us to go through and such? But, I mean, yes, her little part, mm. We can, once again, inside out. <laughs> in a nutshell with us. That ass. But, um, it just makes me wonder how this is going to go next week. Especially because, yeah. You're avoiding the one place you didn't want to go to. And now that we're there, like, what's she going to be? Hi hiding behind the house? <laughs> I, I don't know why, but I can see her hiding behind the house. Or she just runs up. But see, that'll be a little too easy. Like, I feel like with Meek, she's going to have a little fight. She's not going to be like Flirty, where Flirty just like, she took it. She literally was like, okay, let me do one little lasting impression on her, and then I'm out. Meek, I don't know. But, like, what, like I said, once we get to God, that's going to be a different situation. Like, see, that's what you need to bring out, like, the switchblade and everything. We need weapons because it's God, for Christ's sake. I'm just saying because, girl, we know how she's capable of what she is capable of so yeah weapons yes but you know we'll probably see that in like two weeks from now <laughs> other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episode three of the amount of city series off and monster if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day join my squad and of course and i will see you guys officially all next saturday for episode four but until then i hope you guys I don't know. I will see you guys all next time. Bye. I used the wrong hair, so bye. <laughs>